Hey Snap, it's Lacey, aka I Beat That Face from Instagram. I'm taking over the Snap today. If you want to see me get ready, keep watching. So first I'm just brushing my brows into place. So I'm just using the Urban Decay Brow Tamer. This has a tint to it and just holds my brows down. And it lightens them up just a little bit. While that dries, I'm going to go ahead and apply my Smashbox Primer Oil to give me a dewy finish and keep my makeup on. And I just massage it in. I put three little dots and just rubs it in and it absorbs quickly. And my face was already moisturized as well. I'm just applying the tiniest amount of eyeshadow primer on my lids and under my eyes. Just the Urban Decay Anti Aging Eyeshadow Primer. It helps to smooth out my crinkly eyelids since I'm so dry. I'm just using the same concealer I used to clean my brows, the MAC Studio Sculpt and Spot Cover My Nose. I apply my concealer and it's the LA Girl Pro Concealer in Pure Beige. I like to let it set just so that it gets the most coverage. I learned that tip from Miss Aaliyah J. Now just blend your life away, honey. Yes. Blend, 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 blend. take a small amount of powder on my beauty blender and just press it right where the wrinkles are because we just want to set I don't really like I don't really like to bake so much because it looks like really dry on my skin I don't know maybe I have to try it again but it didn't so yeah I just take it wherever I get more oily on my nose and right where I get wrinkly just so that it does increase or wear off during the day so now we're gonna contour with the LA Girl Pro Concealer in dark cocoa. I give up on me like a marriage. I went back inside the attic, counted up and start laughing. <laughs> I went back inside the attic. Now I'm just setting with my Kat Von D powder in the shade 62. Just a light layer because we don't want it to get heavy. Mine is all ugly, but I'm going to take the banana color, put that under my eye. Just right under, down my nose, chin. This one for bronzing. Then I love my City Colors Contour Kit because it's so deep and I only got it for like $2 at some clothing store. This is my Shani Cosmetics and I guess you could guess which one I'm about to use today, huh? This little bad boy right here is my favorite. One's favorite part highlighter is Swiss from ColourPop. But look how gorgeous. And it is kind of like a wet, spongy texture, but that's okay. Do you guys see this glow? She's just honey. I've had this for like two years now, but it is my e.l.f. P. 
Pinktastic blush, and I use this for a highlight as well. So this is normally my face routine, like no matter what makeup I do. Sometimes my contour will be a little darker or my highlight will be a little brighter. I really don't know what I want to do to my eyes right now. Hmm. Decisions. Decisions. I think I'm going to go for my handy dandy 35O palette today. Probably using this color and that color. Let me just give you guys a quick run through of my favorite blending brushes. These two I use for my transition and my crease. The MAC is more for transitioning because it's more fluffy, kind of spaced out. Sorry, it's dirty. And this one is the Morphe M330. This one's more compacted a little bit, just to place a little more color in the crease for blending. This one came in my Smashbox palette, but it looks exactly like the MAC 217 brush. I use this also for placing color and blending in my crease. Is the Morphe E17. I use this one basically for placing like the darker colors on the outer corner, like black and things like that, because it's very dense. Picking up this one as my transitional shade, placing it right in the crease. I had my LA Girl Pro Concealer as a base, the same one I used to highlight. Pure. Mixing these two for warmth and depth. Taking this NARS eyeshadow pencil for the lid, just to give a little bit more color and more sheen. Now I'm just applying Kapow, just because I like the way they look together. Also from Colourpop. Okay, so this is going to be kind of hard to do my hair with one hand, but let's see how that goes. I take my scarf off, take my hair out, shake it. Let me first tell y'all about this hair. This is the Brazilian Curly. Um, I've had this hair for like two or three years, I think. So far, this is my favorite texture from them. So first when I got it, it was like a dark brown. Then it was blonde. Then I had it like a aqua blue. So then I had an aqua blue. Now it's like a green. You guys can't see it in here, but it's like a kind of like an emerald green. And literally I could still run my fingers through my hair, which is good for it to ble bleach so many times. Um, so how I style it is first I section it. So once I have it sectioned off, I comb it all the way through. After I get it sectioned, take my spray bottle, really saturate this bad boy with water. After I get it saturated, I usually use this on my hair, but I'm out. So today I'm going to try again the Curly Sexy. And you can see the curls are really starting to pop already. Like literally, I love this texture, like love it. Now I'm just gonna spray this on my hair. Usually I use the penetrating oil, but trying something new for the past couple of days, I like it so far. But it Now the best part is the John Frieda Frizzies Curl Reviving Mousse, and it literally holds the hair like all day, like no frizz, nothing. Like. So I split the top half, do the same thing to the top half. So I tried to get in some better light so you could kind of see the color and the texture of the hair, but <sighs> you can't see really until it's dry. I'll let you see the hair when it's all dry for you guys. Um, so this is the look here. 
And I, of course, really hope you guys liked my get ready with me. Um, that's my first time ever doing something like that. So this was really fun. Um, just let me know how you like it. You guys can also follow me on Instagram and Snapchat. Uh, my Instagram is I beat that face. My Snapchat is Lacey Lacey. And I have in two bundles and a closure. Um, I don't know what length the hair is now. Um, it was longer when I got it. But.